of sea turtle hunters. We are searching for the leatherback sea turtle, or also known as Dermophilus caridicae. These sea turtles are up to three to five feet wide and six to seven feet tall. And they can weigh up to, to from 500 to, to 1,500 pounds. All right, on our voyage to find the leatherback sea turtle, we are searching the Atlantic, Pacific, and the Western Pacific Oceans. They are a worldwide species and are found in the open ocean. They are found as north as Alaska and the southern tip of Africa. For a, as a threatened species, so they are very endangered. The biggest threat to these sea turtles is bycatch, because from commercial fisheries. Additionally, pollution, like all of this trash that surrounds me, affects these sea turtles as well, because their main appetite is, is jellyfish. And you see these plastic bags? If you're a sea turtle, that looks like your favorite snack. So, pollution has a huge toll on the, these sea turtles because eating this causes them to choke and die. Additionally, humans kill nesting females for meat and oil and dig up their eggs for food. Coastal development threatens sea turtles as well because they, can't come, they come to the beaches that they um, were born at to lay their eggs and their nesting area is gone. You don't want a condo where you're trying to have your kids. But since, and also, since these sea turtles spend a lot of time at the surface, boat propellers often hit them and kill and injure them. What can we do to help the leatherback sea turtles? You can help by not littering, participating in beach cleanups. Mark, uh, marking nesting areas so humans don't stay away from nests, and also just by being conscious of your trash and other recreational uses of the ocean. Thank you. so that they can live. 